Oh boy, I've been waiting for this moment for a month now. What's going on guys and welcome back to some more Sonic Adventure DX and in the last part we finished up Amy's story and if you're wondering why I'm so excited right now, in this part we're going to do Big the Cat story. I've been hyping this up the whole playthrough and I've been waiting for this for a month. Let's do this. Oh, that Bergie! Yeah, uh, expect a lot of, uh, jokes about this particular, uh, character, but, uh, it's pretty obvious that Big the Cat is not a well-liked character, but, uh, he, we start off in the jungle in the Mystic Ruins, and, um... And Big the Cat is just sleeping there with his fishing rod. And there's a power up below him, but that he cannot get to. And there's the frog. The froggy. And there's chaos. But this is gonna get especially funny in a minute. And chaos is coming for froggy. All right, here it comes. He's gonna wake up and he's too fat to wake up also. Wow, fat shaming. Froggy. Here comes the best line. There's no way it's the next line. It's when he's gonna, it's when he swallows the Chaos Emerald. He's gonna, look at this. You swallowed my lucky charm! Come back, Froggy! I just find this hilarious. And not only that, fun fact, uh, the guy that voices Duke Nukem, uh, John St. John, was also Big the Cat. That's also the funny, one of the funniest parts, that he went from Duke Nukem to Big the Cat. And we're in Station Square all of a sudden. Where are you, Froggy? Alrighty, so let's get to Big the Cat's controls. Uh, he's the slowest character in the whole game. If you thought Amy was slow, like, this is nothing compared to Big the Cat. And he can't even, he cannot really jump very high. He can attack with his fishing rod. And, uh, yeah, these are basically Big the Cat's controls. And really, the um, we have to go down the sewers. And if we talk to this guy, the train station isn't open yet. Then how did I get here? How do you get to Station Square if the train st station is a little bit less to some? Yeah, if you thought Amy was slow, uh, Big the Cat is ten times slower than Amy, but, um, we just have to go to the sewers and, um, look, there's Froggy! There's Froggy! There you are! There you are, Froggy! Yeah, I've been waiting to crack Big the Cat jokes just for a wait, just for a whole month now. <laughs> and look what Big the Cat can do. He can uh, lift. He can lift a whole fucking car. <laughs> and uh, let's just say Big the Cat cannot reach this right here. But uh, let's just say big, what Big the Cat can also do is he can go to this area we previously couldn't. A Sonic. And we just have to waddle our ass over here. Jeez, big. Th if you thought Amy was slow, like, I don't know, it's like, oh, my tail! But anyway, so, um. Yeah, let's just, uh, we have to waddle our way over to Twinkle Park, and here we go. Here's the first of the Big the Cat levels, if I can even go in there. 
We're in Twinkle Park. Let's see. Oh, can I get stuck in the door? Can I get the tail stuck in the door? No, I can't. All right. Twinkle Park. So these are the Big the Cat levels. Um, they work a little bit differently, let's just say drastically differently is what I meant. So we have to fish for and catch froggy. We cannot go to an end goal unlike we could with other characters. So um, basically, uh, we have to basically catch froggy in the pond right here. And the bigger the the, be the better power we have, the bigger fish we can catch. But anyway, you have to kind of locate Froggy. And uh, where is Froggy, by the way? Um, I am drowning. Anyway, so um, if you get caught in the water like this, you have to basically uh, use the spring to go back up. We can eventually get a power up that allows us to go underwater. But um, yeah, you, you kind of have to just. Uh, Okay, there's Froggy down there. So uh, we have to kind of, we have to, we have to kind of lure him, and uh, basically we have to hit down every time he he's he's approaching the bait. Except he's not really going near the bait. You basically hold A to reel in, but uh, yeah, I don't think I did have the right angle, but um, I do not think I had the right angle, but. Um, Big the Cat, let's just say his levels can take anywhere between a few minutes or an excruciatingly long time. But I do know where Froggy is, I just gotta have the right angle. Alright, we just gotta lure Froggy in. Why aren't you coming for my bait, Froggy? Oh, so you can use the, uh, you can, I did not mean to, uh, reel back, but, uh, you can basically, uh, Froggy should be in this area, so uh, he always stays in the same area, so, um... Oh, shit. No, you're not- You're not Froggy! You're not Froggy! Also, if your line snaps, that also counts as a death, so just keep that in mind. Uh, but, uh, yeah, we should be able to, uh... Let's just sink the lure. I am not very good at fishing controls, by the way, just keep that in mind. Uh, we have to kind of... Get froggy over here. There we go. He's coming. He's coming. All right. All right. Yeah. And then you have to. And then you can die, but you have to. Uh, yeah. You have to. Uh, you have to basically spin the controls. Like I died on the first big the cat level. Let's just say. Uh, let's just try this again. Remember, I am not very good at fishing levels, so, um... Come on! Come on, Fergie! Yeah, you have to spin the control stick to reel him in. Why isn't it reeling? Okay, that. Come on, Fergie! There we go, there's Fergie! I am dancing because I caught Fergie! Yay! Yeah, basically how you get A ranking is you need to use the power-ups and catch better fit and catch bigger fish. That's how you get A ranking in these levels. But uh I am not even gonna remotely bother doing that. Let's go to Twinkle Circuit instead. Let's go to Twinkle Circuit instead. So uh yeah, Big the Cat basically is the fastest driver in Twinkle Circuit, so um yeah, he has the hardest time steering, but he's the fast guy. It's like using Bowser in Mario Kart, let's just say. So he is overall the fastest driver. So, um, I think when you're in the ramps, you can actually die because you missed the ramp because you went too fast, let's just say. So, uh, I think I've had that happen before, but, uh, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Be honest, this playthrough is probably the most amount of fun I'm ha I've ever had using Big the Cat. Like, Big the Cat is not very good gameplay wise. Just he's, he's just easy to crack jokes out of. Let's just say. Okay, we got 50 rings, and uh, yeah, believe it or not, it is possible to die in the racing in in the in the Twinkle Circuit. Um, 
I did get a sub three minute as Amy, so let's just see if we fare better as Big the Cat. I think we are faring better as Big the Cat than we did with Amy. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I almost went through that. I almost went through that exact thing. Also, a, a, a fun fact. Do you want to, basically, um, the reason why there's hidden Big the Cat stickers in every level in Sonic Adventure 2 is because Sega didn't exactly appreciate the backlash towards Big the Cat, let's just say. So, yeah, that was basically done to spite the, uh, to spite the fan base. So, uh, yeah, and he's also playable in Sonic Heroes. He is not used it much anymore. So, um, he has not been used in years, but, um. I don't know, it's like, um, Sonic, Big the Cat is the Sonic Adventure, what Jar Jar is the Phantom Menace, he's just too easy to crack, he's just an, e he's just an easy target, let's just say, wow, I might even get a sub two minute, that was fucking fast, let's just say, And we did not get an emblem, so, uh, yeah, you don't have to do that as, a uh, Big the Cat, so, uh, yeah, wait, it's a strange we didn't get an emblem, but, uh, Station Square. At, so, um, we have to kind of leave Station Square. The good thing about Big the Cat is that you can get through a story pretty quickly, actually. It's only four levels, much like Amy's story. So, yeah, Ice Stone. That means we have to go to the Mystic Ruins. But, uh, but quickly, I want, I want to quickly grab something. It's just a lore power up in. Um, you got a lore power up, and there's no cutscene, also. He uses a sketch figure fish. Where was the new cutscene for me? Why does any other character get it? Alright, so, uh. We have to take this ice down in the Mystic Ruins. And, uh, yeah, we have to slowly waddle our asses over to the train, so, uh... Hold on, I think it's Big the Cat you can get stuck in the door, so let me just, uh, try it really quick. I think we- I think you get stuck in the door. Alright, look at this. Alright, okay. Come on. Oh, 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 oh. I didn't even get his tail stuck in the door. Yeah, Mystic Ruins. The yeah, still looks like you can use it again. It's using the Mystic Ruins, but um, and we have to jump our f way off the uh, yeah. Let's just say I like Big the Cat, but not exactly for the right reasons. Let's just say because this gameplay is atrocious. Like I've I've seen I've seen I've known people that have like never finished Sonic Adventure because they didn't bother playing the Big the Cat levels. Look at how slow he is. Uh, like what's this? You've discovered the life belt. It keeps you afloat when you're in water. To swim underwater, press the jump button when afloat. But I can still drown, right? Okay, we're gonna test this. Can he still drown in this water? Wait a minute. Okay, you have to you have to hold A to sink. We're gonna fucking drown. Yeah. Any minute now, we're gonna drown Big the Cat. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. Alright, so let's actually go to Ice Cap properly. We're bringing it to Big the Cat levels done in one video. If we can climb up this fucking ladder that is big, come on! I can clip through ladders. Cause I'm... Fish for, again, fish for and catch Froggy and uh... Yeah, we can use the boulders to break the ice. I, there is an ice power, there is a, there is a power up we can get in this level. I don't think I'm gonna go for all the power ups. Pick this up. And, uh, 
Believe it or not, I think Froggy is put in the same location every time you play the big levels. Like, he, like you can end this stage and like, really with the big the cat levels, if you know where Froggy is, you can end these levels in like five, a few minutes, let's just say. I think there's a one up up here that I think I might need. Can I not fall down, please? I think there's a one up up to this top, but um. No! Fine, let's go get Froggy. Froggy, you're in this ice. How did you get under the ice, Froggy? Why am I not? Come on. I just noticed I can know a really good big voice. Why am I not? Hold on. You have to be in the right. Let's just let's just try to see if we can get another um. Okay, I clipped. I clipped through the ice. Yay! There we go. Let's end this. Yes, I know I'm not getting. I know I'm not getting a power up. Come on, Froggy! Come on, Froggy! Uh, there we go! This Froggy! Yes, I am aware I didn't get a power up in the stage. I don't think I need all the power ups. Alright, Mystic Ruins, and, um, pretty much, um, now it's night time. Can I get out of the water, please? Please? Get me out of the water! Alright, there we go. He moves so fucking slowly. <laughs> Can we just get down this? Uh, woo! Oh, this is gonna be great. There he is! And look, he's just gonna trip. Woo! And Froggy's just gonna leave again. Froggy! Alrighty, so I will cut it off for this part of Sonic Adventure DX. So, next time on Sonic Adventure DX, I think we have to go back to Station Square, but, um. You may find something. Yeah, we'll do that in the next part. So,. Next time on Sonic Adventure DX, going to Station Square. See you guys then.